again. So it's good to see you back. I actually just recently had a conversation with somebody who asked me, what is a pesticide? That's a really good question. A lot of people don't know what that word means and they think it means really harmful chemicals. When in reality, there's a lot more to a pesticide and there are a lot of different types of pesticides. A pesticide is defined as any substance that is used to control organisms that are considered harmful. So this can be anything from a mosquito to a fungus or a dandelion in our backyard. Now, the important thing to note is that a pesticide is not necessarily a man-made chemical. Many of the chemical compounds used in pest control are actually created from naturally occurring compounds such as cyanide. Cyanide is known to be toxic to humans, however, we regularly encounter it in apples when we eat them. Apple seeds actually contain a form of cyanide. A really great example of a naturally occurring set of pesticides are vinegar and essential oils. So a lot of people will mix vinegar with things like tea tree oil, lemongrass, rosemary, basil, and so many others. There are actually organic pesticides on the market right now that are basically concentrated forms of vinegar or also sometimes called acetic acid. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that there are many different types of pesticides and there are many different types of pests. It's always important to look at your label and make sure you understand what you're reading. And if you ever run into questions about what it says, you can always reach out to your local pesticide safety education program. Thanks again for stopping by. If you feel like you have any questions, you can always reach out to us by contacting us through our Facebook or through our website, which is pestad.unl.edu.